Good day, ladies and gentlemen. Pastor Jim Reese just checking in with you, see how you're doing. You know, I'd love to just, just to share a couple of things with you every now and then. How about something really unusual? Elijah, the prophet, powerful prophet of God. Chapter 6 of 2 Kings says this, starting at verse 1. One day the guild of prophets came to Elijah and said, You can see that this place we're living in is under your leadership is getting really cramped. We have no elbow room. Give us permission to go down to the Jordan River where each of us will get a log and we'll build another place. Elijah said, Go ahead. One of them said, Well, please come along with us. And he said, Certainly. Then he went with them, and they came to the Jordan River and started chopping down trees. And as one of them was felling a timber, means cutting a tree down, his axe head flew off, uh, sank in the river. Oh no, man, he cried. And, and it was borrowed. The holy man said, that's Elijah, where did it sink? The man showed him the place, and he cut off a branch and tossed it in the spot in the river. And the axe head floated. Grab it, he said. The man reached out and took it. Listen, I don't guess we should be really astounded at these kinds of things because God is good. Good grief, he's done some miraculous things in my life. Uh, we'll just have to talk about this another time. But man, I'm telling you what, an axe head. You ever held an axe head? That's a good five pounds, at least. You know, depending on the size of the axe, could be heavier. But it was a borrowed axe, and the prophet, you know, he was very concerned because it was a borrowed axe head. Well, lo and behold, the man of God, operating under the anointing of the Holy Spirit, just tossed a simple piece of tree limb in there, where in the same general area, and the axe head floated to the top, and he said, grab it. And they did. God is good all the time, and all the time, God is good. Let's always thank him for all the things he does for us each and every day. And hey, listen, always share these stories with your children and your family. Amen. Y'all have a good day, and I will see you again at the appointed time.